Advice UK is a, an organisation of social welfare law advice services, so our members help people with debt problems, benefit problems and housing problems. One of the big problems that, that advice services face, and it's also a problem for, for benefits administrators, is loads and loads of demand coming through the door and for advice services this is only getting worse because welfare cuts mean that, that, that more and more people come for, are coming for help. So what we do is we try and put, put methods in place to ration demand. Studying the work as a system was, was really interesting for us because um, in the world of advice services um, what we're used to doing is opening our doors to people who have problems with debt or benefits or housing um, and helping them fix those problems. However, when we came to, to look at advice services as a system, what you immediately see is that things are very different, that actually most of the demand that's coming to you is, is failure demand. It's, it's demand that's driven in by uh, public services, the agencies that people are having to deal with, uh, such as benefits administration, not getting it right or not getting it right first time. So the immediate realisation was that rather than trying to manage our queues more efficiently, where we need to focus our attention is on working with those services to help them understand how they can get it right first time and stop the demand coming to us in the first place. But of course, by doing that, they're also improving their service and lowering their costs as well. When we studied across the, the two systems, advice services and benefits services working together, and started doing things differently, uh, we saw some fairly dramatic results in terms of the time it took for people to get the advice that they needed and to get their problems solved. What we learned was previously it was taking about 100 days uh, end to end for someone to get their benefit resolved. As soon as we started working differently that fell to 23 days and within a short time when people were getting used to doing things differently it fell to five days. And recently we've had uh, some independent evaluation of the work and that's shown that that improvement has sustained over time. For advice services, it's now taking only a quarter of the time end-to-end -end that it used to take to solve people's problems. For the local authority, um, it's only half the time. Uh, and so that inevitably has a huge impact uh, on the, the quality of service that people receive, but also on the capacity of those services to help more people because they're getting things resolved more quickly uh, and so able to deal with, with the rising demand that's coming to them. I guess the key learning for us has been um, the importance of agencies working collaboratively around the needs of the customer. Uh, and by doing that, you get a much, much deeper perspective on what the real issues are. Um, we got a much clearer understanding end to end of where the problems lay in the system and it enables you to design a system that really works for people, solving their problems as quickly as possible with, without undue delays and for you as an organisation, reducing your cost and helping you constantly improve based on the knowledge that you've gained.